So this is the Russell Coastal Defence Scheme, completed in 2018 at a cost of about £64 million, with funding from the Environment Agency. And it's built in three sections. So there's a lower rock revetment that goes down to the beach, and that helps to dissipate the energy of the waves and the tide. The spaces between the rocks are just as important as the actual rocks themselves. You can hear it, but you can also see the water lapping in between the stones. Then there's a middle summer berm, which is a, a space in promenade that splits the bottom from the top sections. And then the top section is built in precast concrete step units. And they also, apart from the fact that they're attractive, they also form a function because of the way that they, they dissipate the energy of waves which hit them. So we're going to walk up to the top level. There's an access point at this end for lifeboats, um, emergency vehicles, etc., which you can see in front of us. And that takes you down to the split level promenade. And then we go around here and back up the steps. So you can see how near we are to Blackpool. You can see Blackpool Tower in North Pier in the right hand side of the shop. The green The green thing stuck up in front of us at the top of the ramp is a way marker designed to look like one of the blades of grass and that's to orientate yourself with where the gateways are to the promenade if you're on the beach and can't find your way back to where you came from. So the promenade here is built in split levels again. And each level forms a function whereby if any water comes over this intermediate wall it drains back through the holes in the sea wall at the bottom there and then the next section of steps catches any more waves that actually manage to make it that far and finally the rear wall is the last line of defence. Beautiful public realm, lovely asset, well worth a visit.